So a little breath in, right? tiny breath. As soon as that first cut goes in, I'm not stopping. Scarification is seen as something abhorrent. He might be a heavy bleeder, in which case you just make a little nick and he goes Pfft. I'm here to hold his hand. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> yes. <laughs> So I'm getting it done roughly around here. I need to see what it looks like when it's on. It's similar to a tattoo, but a little bit more extreme. When it comes to the actual procedure, it'll be a scalpel. He'll cut two to three millimeters deep. He'll then apply UV ink. Scarification, it's a gray area. In this environment, it's a very safe space. and it's in a controlled environment, it's very hygienic. We're trying to break the taboo on it the best we can. You know, not so long ago, tattoos were taboo. I like the thought that it will be a scar and then when UV light shines on it, it will glow up. So I go on holiday or night clubbing, it's black light, so I'll be taking my top off and showing everyone. The worst would be too deep or infection. Or the calloid scar might appear a bit bigger than I expected. I will feel pain, there's no going about that. I guess it's like nervous anticipation, you know. Hey, how you doing? Nice to meet you. Good to meet you as well, mate. Welcome to our studio. Thank you. Right, so what have we put on you today? Right, a question mark, plain and simple. It's very important for us to get across to people that are having this, um, that they're in the right, you know, sound of mind and body. And that's where I sign my life away. Okay, Ben, do you want to pop in? That's it. Just lay yourself back. Watch your head. Okay. You ready? Yeah. Are you ready? Always. A little breath in, a right? tiny breath. You ready? You feel that? Mm -hmm. Depending on where you cut on, on, the, on the body as well, it will depend on how it splays. So you should be really, really careful. Right. Um, so if you cut, so up here for example, and you press too deep, it will just do this. I would say I thought it was going to hurt a lot more than it does, to be honest. You ready to see it? Yeah, indeed, yes. Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's wicked. Are you sure you're happy with that? Yeah, I'm very happy with that, mate. So, we're going to put some UV ink in. should start to travel into the grooves, yeah, and then it just literally does its own thing. It's definitely beyond the normal. Oh! Sorry. I can only just see it, but it's just It's cool. glowing. I feel like it's a bit quite a big relief now it's done. I'm looking forward to healing and showing it off. What kind of people do you imagine get scarification done? People that don't want follow the normal rules, I guess. Um, people that like to challenge boundaries and push for things that are different. At the end of the day, no one wants to be the same as anyone else. Each to their own, my body, my rules. That's what it looks like at the moment. So we give it a little flash, the UV torch. When you turn the light off, happy days. Bitch, I got prelims on prelims on prelims on prelims on prelims on prelims that's all, but my run through the money, the pressure be calling. Left on my blessings, I feel like I'm falling. The birdie is back. Tell me I'm garbage, I'm going through something. I ain't calling. Phone and progression is all that I wanted. The phone